Well, Michael, as you can imagine, they are just still grappling with her death. A dedicated vet technician, friend, and mother, her boss tells me what a loss this is to the community. She's definitely going to be missed. You know, everybody's uh, just kind of feeling, I think, a little empty. The death of Christina Parcell leaves a hole in the community. She was just fun to be around and, uh, you know, somebody that you would enjoy talking to. The 41-year-old was found dead in her home in the Canebrake neighborhood of Greer Wednesday. Christina worked as a vet technician at Foothills Veterinary Hospital for several years. We'll miss her expertise for sure, but I think, you know, more than anything, you know, over the three years that she, um, you know, worked here, um, she just made a lot of friends. And, and I think mostly people are going to um, miss her friendship and just miss her, you know, her presence around the office. Intelligent, capable, yet fun. All words her boss used to describe Christina. She also had a, a really, um, you know, kind of uh, um, dry wit about her that um, kind of always kept, um, you know, everyone smiling. That was her when she got back from um, Italy with her. Even more importantly, he says, a devoted mother. There were a couple times when I got to, you know, be around her, you know, and her daughter, you know, together. Her daughter was, um, you know, such a, um, you know, a, a bright light and had a, just a kind spirit. If you could leave Christina with some parting words. I think I would be more intentional just about saying thank you, um, you know, for everything she, you know, did for us. Dr. Randall says they would eventually like to put together a memorial fund to help support her daughter. If you live in the Canebrake neighborhood in Greer, the Greenville County Sheriff's Office is asking everyone to check their security camera or ring doorbell footage specifically between 6 a.m. and 11 a.m. on Wednesday. They're asking you to look for any suspicious person or suspicious vehicle. If you have any relevant video footage, you're asked to call the Greenville County Sheriff's Office with that or even any information at all. You can also call Greenville County Crime Stoppers at 23 Crime. Reporting live in Greenville, Kylie Jones, WYFF News 4.